Hi friends. I would really love to invite you into my past. Growing up, I was surrounded by Swedish folklore and the magic and enchantment that filled my home. My mother made it a beautiful place to explore the woods and um, just enjoy the magic of Scandinavian folklore, Swedish folklore, and uh, I'd like to share that with you. Growing up, we had books from Carl Larson and his beautiful artwork surrounding our home and the colors just um, bring a sense of nostalgia for me and I created this class to help you guys the beginners to learn procreate in a fun and magical sort of way. Swedish folk art is filled with this beautiful symmetry and these patterns and some are very simple and some are very intricate and it's hard to know where to begin when you're first trying out new techniques in procreate and trying to figure out what you want to draw next let's do a little research and let me show you first the book that started it all for me this is carl larson's um beautiful watercolor books growing up in my home we had this book and it's well loved some of the pages are starting to fall out but i still love reusing it my mother's sewing tin had this picture on the front so anytime I hopped into her sewing tin that was there. Again this is the picture that I used to pull color from for this class. This is one of my favorites and you see some of the symmetry designs right here and I always thought that it was more magical in Christmas but in fact it is their daughter Emma's birthday and this is how they celebrated can you imagine the magic of your family showing up in your room it's so beautiful I love that his watercolors include some of the symmetry designs as well and that's what we're going to be going over today. We're going to be making symmetry patterns that look like quilt squares in Procreate. We're going to gather some inspiration off of Pinterest and I've given you guys a download to, um, to look over and it has a procreate kit and with colors and stamps and everything that you need to create these beautiful designs just so you guys are aware this watercolor brush is from my perch handmade watercolor brush set which you can purchase on my website but for right now we're just using the one that I'm sharing with all of you for this class. We're going to sketch out our quilt squares using the Procreate stamps and it'll make it really simple to put them in there and add a few designs um, to create these beautiful pieces of artwork. I'm Katie from Perch Handmade and I'm here to help you along on this journey and walk you through the steps in this beginner's class. So follow along in the next lesson and we are going to get started.